All right, y'all, we are back with another video. I told y'all I was gonna be consistent, so every couple days I'm gonna be posting long forms of content, just breaking down my life experiences, some things that I may have learned that I wanna share with you guys, or just anything that I'm kinda of feeling, anything that kinda of comes across my head. So let's get into the video. So how I got into personal development, fitness, why I decided to get into this, here is the story. So. Since the age of five or six, I have been playing sports from soccer to baseball to basketball to football and eventually to lacrosse. My parents always put me into sports. As far as I grew up, the only things that I really knew was sports, music, and clothes. My father was in the clothing industry and he really introduced me to music, hip hop especially, R&B, Michael Jackson, like all sorts of music. That's really all I knew. And I actually had a collegiate career where I played Division One lacrosse at the University of Utah for five years. Be standing at the height of 5'8 on a good day, 150, 160 pounds, I was able to get an athletic scholarship to go to the University of Utah and play against some of the best competition, the best world-class athletes in the world, get trained by some of the best trainers in the world. So it was a very cool experience. I got to learn a lot about myself what determination is, willpower, work ethic, uh, self-confidence, self-belief, like all of those attributes I learned and were installed in me as, at a young age, just being able to rise to the cream to the top and, and eventually get a scholarship at the highest level of collegiate level. But it was about six months ago, where I looked at my life and I have a brand called Sore Thumb. It's a clothing brand. What I'm currently still working on, a lot of people think, oh dang, he just put those out. He put that on the back burners. No, I'm still working on that on a consistent daily basis. Just because you guys don't see me posting every single day on what's going on, doesn't mean I'm not working on it. But I just realized I had skills that I could help people and really make a difference in people's lives. Because I remember at one point in my life, I was super skinny. This was when I was very young, like eight to the age of 17 years old. I really struggled with gaining weight. I really struggled with putting on muscle. I really struggled with all of that. And it bugged me. And when it came to football, when it came to sports, I always had to eat more than others. I also had to work harder than others. I was the smallest kid on my team, weight-wise as well as height-wise. Every situation, I was the smallest guy, the smallest cat on the team. And then when I got a little bit older, when I graduated, when I was about last year till now, last year until maybe a few months ago, I was somewhat overweight. I had a gut. I was not satisfied of how I looked in the mirror. I was just not where I wanted to be. So I've been on both sides of the spectrum as far as being very skinny, couldn't gain any weight, to also having a gut, overweight, not satisfied of how I looked, was drinking a lot, had that beer belly, all of that. So I've been on both sides of the spectrum and I just realized I've been fit before. I know how, I, I understand how to get fit. I understand how to get a six pack. Um, so I realized through my own personal development journey of me bettering myself, just working out on a consistent basis because I wasn't satisfied on that previous version of myself being overweight. So I transformed my whole body to being fit. Now I'm 6% body fat, 150, 160 pounds. I think I'm 155 pounds right now. And 6% body fat and the most fit I've ever been. I go to the gym every single day. I've been going for about nine months straight. And through that journey, as well as my early years, I just realized I understand how to help people get fit, lose weight, put on muscle, eat better, personal development, build your mindset up. All of those attributes I learned through my whole personal journey of sports and just my whole life. And I was helping my mom get fit. I was helping my sister work out in different exercises. I was helping my friends get a six pack and telling them different ab exercises they should do. And then I realized that I could really help people in this space because of the credibility I have of being a division one athlete, being at the top level of 
college sports. I've been working out since the age of 12. And I know so many people struggle with getting fit. I know so many people right now, if they could have the chance, if they could just snap their fingers on being fit, I know everyone in their mom would, would choose to. But I just realized a lot of people are lazy. A lot of people don't understand how to get fit. A lot of people say they want to get fit, but don't want to put the work in or don't know where to start. So why not help people? So I took a step back and I was looking at my life and I was like, let's try this. I have the skills, I have the knowledge, I have the credibility to help people. I can really transform this into something special and let alone the money, which is cool, but I can help change people's lives at the end of the day and make them feel better about themselves, which is one of the coolest things in the world. So I started it. So from a few months before 2024 started, I told myself every single day I'm gonna work out. And me just showcasing that, documenting that on my Instagram story, YouTube, all these other social media platforms that I was posting it on on a consistent basis, I was easily getting leads. And then I started posting on my Instagram, I'm looking for five people who wanna get fit in the next 90 days. And I had a bunch of leads reach out to me because I was already nurturing all my followers, telling them, look, I'm putting all the work in on a consistent basis. This is not just me showing up to the gym the first day and asking for people who want to get fit. You know, I was already putting in months of work, getting my body right, showcasing my, me getting my body right, showcasing me having a six pack, etc. So when, I, when it came time to me posting, looking for five people who want to get fit, I had a bunch of people outreach me. And I, I eventually signed a lot of people and now I have basically a whole community of people who are under my wing trying to better themselves in the next 90 days, the next 180 days, the next six months of me helping people get fit. So within my program, everything that it entails is custom tailored workout program based on your schedule, based on what you're looking to do, based on your goals, just for you. So it's upper body, lower body, abs, every, every muscle on your body is targeted and it's gonna get you the results that you're looking for. Number two, what comes with it is a nutritional guide with a weekly grocery list, understanding carbs, fats, all of that, protein intake, carb intake, all of that, as well as different meal plans for you, and even some fast food options that list carbs, proteins, calories, all of that, just for my clients. As well as we have some daily accountability stuff. We're in a group chat where everyone sends in their pictures, to better themselves, showcase off transformations, etc., And then also we have a personal development segment where on the weekly check-ins we do a little activity to build your mindset, to build your confidence up, to build just your whole thought process behind yourself and about, around your environment and everything, just building you up into the person that no one can stop except yourself. And I think when people realize that and actually believe in that, they'll change. And the last thing is just having my contact information to hit me 24 seven to realize that I am a resource for them and for them to take advantage of me helping them because again, they, they see my daily discipline of me showing up to the gym, me bettering myself every single day. I do not take a day off. The thing is with all my clients that I'm working with currently, it, I'm already disciplined. I'm self-disciplined, I'm self-accountable and I'm very hard on myself because I want the best for myself and I realize in order to become the best version of myself, I need to have those things in order. I can't miss a day, I can't wake up late, I can't say I'm gonna take a day off. I need all of those things in order and every single day I'm checking those things off. And what makes me go even harder and be even more consistent and be even more disciplined is now that I have clients under me, multiple, and if you guys don't believe me, go on my Instagram, go on all these other social media platforms. I post their testimonials, I post their transformations, all of that. But it makes me go even harder is they're relying on me. They're expecting me to show up every day. And if I don't, I'm letting them down, vice versa. I'm expecting all of them to get better. I'm expecting all of them to put the work in. If they don't, they're letting me down. So it's a two-way street and it's every, every single person in this 90-day program that I'm working with is becoming their best version of themselves every single day. A little bit better every single day. That's what I'm pushing.
You know, and not every day are you gonna get better. Some days you're gonna miss a workout and that's okay. But we try to nip it in the butt and we really try to make you understand that if you don't follow this program, if you don't be consistent, if you don't have accountability, if you don't have the willpower to get out of bed on the days that you don't wanna work out, on the days that you don't wanna do something, don't do it, you'll never see the results that you are looking for. You'll never become the best you if you only rely on motivation. And I really install that in all my clients' head, like, why can't you become the better version of you? Why can't you have that hero-like figure in your head that you visualize about yourself? Why can't you transform into that? And I really install that into their heads that anything is possible if you put your mind to it, if you're consistent, if you show up, if you have the hard work, if you have the discipline that I can help you understand and get to. But if you're liking the sound of everything that my 90-day program offers, my six-month program offers, my three-month program that offers, DM me on Instagram. I'll put my Instagram right here. DM me on Instagram, ready, and we'll get you situated. We'll hop on a call, see if you're a good fit, see exactly what your goals are, and we'll get you signed up and help you become the best version of you because I guarantee you, I can help you. I don't care if you're addicted to drugs. I don't care if you're addicted to alcohol. I don't care where you're at. Mentally, physically, I can get you to become the best you. And I think that's a skill of mine because, again, I was in a very low place in my life before. I had addictions. I was overweight. I was drinking too much. And then on the other side of the spectrum, I wasn't, I had problems and struggles gaining weight, putting on muscle, being too skinny, being made fun of. So I understand both sides of the spectrum. That's why I feel like I can relate to people. That's why I feel like I can really help people and with my credibility. But I just took a step back from everything and I just realized I can really help people with just so much knowledge that I've gained over the years. And again, my credibility, my credibility being a Division One athlete and just at the end of the day, just wanting to help people. You know, I feel like my purpose on this earth is just to help people. I don't know in what shape or form. I originally thought it was through clothes and I still think it is, but I have a love for working out. I have a love for being the best version of you. I have a love for pushing myself. I have a love for accountability, discipline, all of that. And me just helping people every single day, my clients calling me, my clients sending pictures in the group chats, my clients saying they gained four pounds after two weeks being in the program. It just brings a smile to my face and it just, it gives me this warm feeling that I'm helping people. You know, people aren't in the right spot in their life and they come to me because they want to become better. And I think that's a pretty surreal feeling and it makes me happy, I'm not gonna lie. And every day I get to wake up and not only become the best version of myself, help other people become the best versions of themselves and help them believe that too. I feel like so many people's mindset, they, they just have this limiting belief or they don't believe in themselves because as we see, society, we're programmed not to believe in ourselves. We're programmed to have this negative belief or have this limiting belief that we can only achieve this much where you can achieve anything that you put your mind to. And I just really, really hone into that and really have my clients adopt that, that mentality and that, that mindset. Because again, if you realize that no one can stop you, then why, why wouldn't you shoot for the stars? Why wouldn't you shoot for the atmosphere? Why wouldn't you go for it? We only have one life, why, why, what's the risk? The way the universe works, if you put the work in, if you have the determination, if you have the willpower, if you have the accountability, you take no days off, you really want it as bad as you want to breathe, and you never give up, you can have anything that you want. And I hopefully, if you're not in my 90 day program, or you're just watching this, just to understand what this whole video is about, hopefully you understand that message that I just relayed to you. Hopefully, hopefully you understand that. Again, you don't have to like me, you don't have to join my program, but hopefully you realize that if you put the work in, if you want as bad as you breathe, if you never give up, if you believe in yourself, you can have, the, you can have whatever you want. And of course you have to put the work in, you can have whatever you want. The law of the universe works in that way. So that that's basically the reason why I started this personal development mentorship slash coach slash personal fitness coach, as what you can call it. I don't like to have the title of those. I like to say I help people become the best versions of themselves. That's kind of what I say, what I do. 
And I think that's a dope way to basically end the video. I hope people become the best versions of themselves. So again, if you're interested, if you wanna learn more about my program, if you wanna learn more about me, DM me on Instagram. My Instagram will be right here. DM me ready. Let's get you to become the best you. Again, if you're struggling, I can help you. The only person who can change you, you know, I say I can help you become the best you, but you have to be the one willing to take action. You have to be the one who's willing to commit You're, because I, I can't put the work in for you. I can only put the work in for myself. And I tell all my clients that at the first call, when we hop on a call, how bad do you want it? Because if you're committed, I can help you. If you say you're committed and you're not at all, or you're half committed, you're not gonna see the results that you're truly looking for. If you're 100% committed, if you 100% wanna change, if you 100% if you want to become the best version of yourself and you put the work in, there's no reason why you can't become the best version of yourself. I have the systems, I have the knowledge, Again, I have the credibility and I have the, the programs that can help you become the best version of yourself. And again, if you do not believe me, follow me on my Instagram and see every single day of me showing up, me every single day pushing myself outside my comfort zone, me showing up every single day, not caring if I'm sick, not caring if I'm traveling, anything that I'm going through, I will show up. And if you guys do not believe me, follow me on Instagram and see firsthand. So again, I appreciate all of you guys who watched up to this part. I appreciate all of y'all. As always, keep being you. Keep striving to become the best version of yourself. And the last thing I'm going to end off is, again, the only person who can stop you is yourself. Adopt that mentality. Adopt that thinking. And I will see you at the top. Peace.